Come now, Alice. It's only a dream. It's not a dream. It's a memory. And it makes me sick. Now, focus. Wait. You're floating again. Weightless. A cipher. Relax. Yeah. I'm in hell. Forget it. Abandon that memory. It's unproductive. Go to Wonderland. I can't. I'm trapped. My past. Sergeant, this girl's badly burned. Call for a doctor. She'll be all right. My head's exploded and there's a steam hammer in my chest. Yes, well, the cost of forgetting is high. My memories make me vomit. What can I... Remember other things. I want to forget. Who would choose to be alone, imprisoned by their broken memories? I'll set you free, Alice. Memory is a curse more often than a blessing. So you've said many times, and... And I will say again, the past must be paid for. Now... Before our next session, collect those pills from our high street chemist. Very well, Doctor. It's my turn to forget, Alice. Now, Charlie. Your pa was hung for killing your ma who beat you. Let's forget that, shall we? The past is dead, Charlie. Pinch me smalls. Where bloomers? The loo smells awful. Worse than your room? Doctor, do you right? Still sick in the head? I'm past a cure. Terminal condition. I deserve my bitter tears. Want some? Ten years in the loony bin. No ma, no relation. She's an orphan. Mr. Payne had no idea how humble a home could be. If not for my drawings and the photographs, this could pass for my room at the asylum. Doctor's pet. Too good for the asylum. Mad as a hatter without the charm. Another day, a different dream, perhaps. 
Which particular memory do you have? You know the one. She clips up a corner of the You like Paganini, Mrs. Uh, How about Paganini? She ever work? Where's her flat? Too good for company? She don't get close. Hates being touched. Who likes it then? Never slap. Spice more like. Moonbeam windows on the fields of stars. So hush you little ones and have no fear. The man in the moon hears the end of the Outrageous. Outrageous. Hello, Puss. Puss, 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 Puss. Don't be afraid. Seems following furry creatures into dark holes has become a habit. I hope it's not a vice. Stars and garters, Alice Little. Slumming again, are we? Nurse Witless. What luck. Twice in as many months. Out on your own? You look frazzled, dearie. Not doing well? Not really. Come along home then and look at my pigeons. Pretty birds. Like you. I don't think so. Our last visit cost me several pounds and got me nowhere. I might recall where your mangy rabbit got to. Still a mess. No surprise. Her kin roasted like chestnuts right before her eyes. Ten years in Rutledge Asylum wasted everyone's time. Dr. Bumby won't do better. Still hauling out her questions. The fire. Her memory. I deserve consideration, don't I? Who found her her new clothes? Who got her a place at Bombay's? Where'd she be without me? On the street, selling her backside. Ooh, like some <laughs> pigeons, though. She's doled out the odd pound or two. But what I know is worth more than that. Kept her secret, haven't I? Her to say, all oh, died on my account. I couldn't save you. I've told her my silence is for sale. She... I'm a good sort, really. Not like her nanny, that uppity whore. Or that lawyer fellow Radcliffe took her stupid rabbit. Need money. Warned her I'd tell the coppers if she didn't make a donation to my upkeep. She yells and goes off her head. Does she can of remember her name? What I heard. Nurse Witless, do you mean to harm me? To send me back to the asylum? I won't say no. I've a first you could photograph. Need a drink. Would my machine need to wash you?
very upsetting journey, but I'm rid of Pris or whatever she's become. At least the place I've landed is somewhat familiar. About time too, Alice. Blasted cat. Don't try to bully me. I'm very much on edge. Perfect. When you're not on edge, you're taking up too much space. You're no help at all. But you know I can be. I'll frighten myself. When necessary, thanks very much. I was hoping to escape from all that. Abandon that hope. A new law reigns in this wonderland, Alice. It's very rough justice all round. We're at risk here. You be on your guard. my girl. Amanita muscaria, Alice, is merely a stinky toadstool. A spongy consistency, but poisonous. I've been down this road before. Good things in small packages? Though lacking a bathing costume, a plunge in that pool is in order. My god! I'm shrinking in this potion! Sh shall I disappear? Almost. But the upside is that while smaller, you can see things that are nearly invisible to your bigger self. Ah, I get it, quite. Forests for the trees, just the other way round. Short-sighted is more than a matter of perspective. <laughs> <laughs> 